All right, hey everyone, Waterbot here, and welcome to Connect Tank. I like Alana, she looks cute. Uh, anyway, so this is, as far as I can tell, it's like a... You're building a tank to fight enemies, but the way you play it is via Factorio-style automation. It looks really cool, so let's get rolling on this. Okay, this is your first gig, fi uh, first gig. Phineas Fatcat, the 15th, doesn't pay us to stand in place. Everyone get moving. All right, so we can move. How do I... No. How do I rotate anything? Okay. Rotating it twice. Nope. That ain't it. What is the rotate button? No, that's throw. Ah, there we go. Okay, not bad. This job requires brains and bronze. Connect belts together to the factory for the cannon. Yeah, uh, if you're wondering why I don't, uh, the button prompts don't do anything for me, I'm playing this on a controller, and it seems to think I'm playing it on keyboard. Alright, you proved that you can lift stuff, but now you need to do more than that to get hired. Something, something. Alright, aim and throw. Enter battle station. Uh, who repaired this tank? Belts are blocked and we have pa packages, packages to ship. Aha, I've been bringing an idea. Pick up a belt and then throw it to replace one of the belts. Okay. Okay. That one just gets loose. I guess I can't necessarily only do this, but that's fine. Let's see. Does this work? No, it does not. So... You cannot have a uh, a curved belt drop onto a straight belt. I like I like the uh, I like these mechanics. They seem pretty cool. Sure, planes exist in New Pangaea, but big honking tanks with super rad designs are freaking awesome. Also, pilots are expensive to employ. Good news for you is that you got cannons to play with. See the colorful piles of scrap over there? You can uh, save New Pangaea and company expenses by recycling it into ammo. Pick up scrap and bring it to the Recyclotron. Be sure to follow one of the blueprints up top. Okay. Okay, so that makes red scrap. Great job, the Recyclotron turns scrapped into something or other. The cannon can shoot from the top or bottom lane. You can control which lane the cannon fires by pressing the cannon switch. I guess the real thing is, I really should be throwing more. Maybe. Uh, let's see, I've been told by an infomercial the Recyclotron is 100% safe. It's totally, probably, possibly unbreakable. Ignore the blueprints, see for yourself. If you don't follow the blueprints, the Recyclotron will make a pile of metal garbage. Compared to ammo, it's pretty weak. I'm digging the music already. It's super charming. Oh yeah, important. Pay attention to the color of your ammo fire. Ammo is stronger or weaker against other ammo, depending on the color of its powerful paints. Yellow beats, uh, red beats yellow. Okay, triangle in the corner. Got it. Not that I have a whole lot of options right now. Okay. So red beats yellow. But we don't have... We do have. There we go. It looks like there might also be a higher tier version of it as well. That's gonna give me blue. There we go. I guess I can just hit that to get some more ammos of a ver variety of types. Question, can I make ammo that is not currently represented by a recipe? No, I can't, so I have to follow one of the pre-existing ones. Well, we might as well get rid of all the blues, though it doesn't really matter. The red raider weakness? Dunno, nuts and bolts, bolts weakness. Okay, so I've got to update this battle station, get it functional, 
and go from there. Okay, you're hired. After you defeat the tanks, so I can open the doors. Cool. Okay, what we want is this one. Did we? No. I am very confused, actually. What is with this rotation? Is there a way that I can flip it? I have no idea. I, I'm already immediately overwhelmed. There we go. Okay, that belongs there. Yeah, is there a way I can flip pieces? Maybe. Uh... Okay, so what beats red? Blue beats red. Oh. But we don't have blue. Okay. I guess I'm just gonna have to go for... I'm gonna take some damage here, I guess. Send that out. Bonk that. Okay, it's throwing a blue. Yellow beats blue, but I don't think I have one of those. So in that case, I'm just going to have to hit him with whatever. Okay. There we go. So I know I can time them at the very least. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do is just hit him with whatever. I'm not mistaken, this will be a yellow. Okay, so we've... We haven't hit him yet. I'm just gonna toss that up there. I don't know what he's up to, but I figure I can probably just wail on him a fair bit just by chucking. Looks like he's aiming up. There we go. Okay, I don't think I have a single thing in yet. Let's try a double red. Because I noticed the double red has kind of like a spiky look to it. Nope, oh, and he dead. Alright, this is really cool. Oh, you only start with one upgraded ammo. Well, this is neat. Yeah, the music is a little repetitive, I agree. Hopefully they update it a little bit. But it... It's Factorio Battle. Congratulations, welcome to, to the Fat Cat Shipping Incorporated. I'm Sean. Great work out there, rookie. Keep an eye out for me in New Pangea. Like other tankers, I moonlight selling ammo and tank mods too. Yeah, so this has kind of an overcooked feel to it. It's overcooked, crossed with Factorio, crossed with Advance Wars? Kind of. Hey, are you new to the co-working space? I'm Katarina. Nice to meet you. Fat Cat just posted a new gig. You can take it by going to the mission select screen. Okay, settings, training, nah, let's go. You can flip through the available gigs here. Gigs with this icon are company priority. Complete these and companies will trust you with more important tasks. Gigs with icon this icon pay big bucks, but they don't improve your rank inside the company that much. But how do buy stuff? How do upgrade tank? I don't know. Guess we can't. Alright, so we got... No choice. Before you head out, choose a tank to drive. Oh, you only have nuts and bolts? Don't worry, you'll be able to build more tanks by collecting tanks during... Uh, tank parts during gigs. Each tank is loaded with different ammo and are further customized with combinations of mods. Okay, Automa automatically restores 10 HP after every battle and get coins. That's nice. 
Ready to take the gig? Sure. I might actually have to, like, grab Shell or s uh, some friends for this. This feels like it would be an incredible game to play with, like, uh, the Wholesome Verse. Anyway. Ah, oh, you must be here about the Connect Tank driver position. I'm Phineas Fatcat the 15th, owner of Fatcat Shipping Incorporated. We're the largest overland shipping company in New Pangaea, founded over 250 years ago by Phineas Fatcat the First. He was my great, 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 you know what, I'm tired of saying great. He was my great times 12 grandfather. Since all of the continents moved together to form New Pangaea hundreds of years ago, business has been very good for our company. We couldn't do it without drivers like you. Brave, heroic, totally independent contractors who will do the hard jobs no, or no one else will. Or at least the jobs no one else would do without benefits. But I digress. It's time to see what you're made of. I'm building a factory, but I need to get the building materials out to the site location. I've loaded up your tank outside. All the materials out there. I'll pay you for the, your troubles. Chop, chop. Time to see your metal. This is cute. Get shell. Maybe. I I think I I get people for the actual like full release. Oh, is it slightly roguelikey? It is. It's Factorio Overcooked Advance Wars, the roguelike. Okay. So it looks like there might be some kind of side paths to take. So we could do a lot of fights if I go to the bottom, but if I go up, we have mysteries. Greetings, brave capitalist and tireless consumer. Everyone's favorite business magnet, Fat Cat, is running the show. That means everything's on sale. Buy ammo. Upgrade ammo. Discard ammo. Upgrade ammo? Okay. So... I have enough money to potentially upgrade a number of these. Okay, it looks like they get progressively more expensive. We can also maybe buy some ammo. It takes a bite out of enemy tanks. Effective against blue ammo, yellow ammo. Whoa! Maybe I should have looked into buying some of these. Yeah, because my upgrades aren't even as fancy as this. I'm going to grab the shark shell. Okay, I'm going to discard this. Oh! Oh, I need money to discard. Really? I guess it makes sense. Okay, weakness is blue. Well, let me see. I've got three, so I think we have a bunch of superfluous pieces. Okay, let's just try and hook this up real quick. Oh, cannot get past that. Okay. Move that. Oh, shoot. What is this? Nope, doesn't look like I can do anything with the boxes. Okay. I like the fact that I can upgrade the ammo. That's kind of a, a neat change of pace. Oh, the switch is here. There we go. Yellow is good against blue. 
What am I throwing? I don't know, but I'm I'm certainly shelling him. I think we actually got him. That was quick. Give him money. Red Raider left arm. Ooh. Okay. Choose one. Rocket ball. How did Jets give this this a speed boost? Effective against yellow ammo. Pronged for more damage. Effective against red ammo. Reinforced. I feel like the prickly canister is probably my best. It's a little slower, but it does a lot of damage. This game is so cute. It is incredibly cute! I have everything an entrepreneur like yourself could need. Okay, so the question marks seem to just be pure, pure shop. Now, I can't upgrade upgraded ammo. Well, in that case... Let's just lose that. At this point, I'd much rather just have... Uh, nothing but upgraded stuff. Is it all just shop? I guess I could have also looked into buying something on sale, but... Yeah, so Mystery Machine was not actually that interesting. Okay. Ooh. Okay, put that there. There. That there. That there. I would love to clean up my own factory, but alas, cannot do. Okay, yellow, and then red. Blue, and then blue. I'm just gonna fire everything. It doesn't really matter too much to me what I'm firing, as long as I'm just out ammoing him. Okay. Gotta point a couple things up high. Stress for me. Okay, we have got combo bonus of plenty. Okay, blue and red. Oops. Red and red. Yeah, I should really pay attention to what I'm firing here. But it Frankly, it doesn't matter much to me. As long as I'm hitting him. Okay. Now time to play a bit defensive. There we go, never mind. He loses. Perfect. Okay, we get money. Mustard Marauder Engine. Do these just get plugged in or do I get them afterwards? I am not sure. Connect tank to delivery. I must admit, half the folks I send out die on the first gig as driver. That's proof of your uh, proof you conduct yourself well in the field. Come back whenever you please, sport. I'll always have a gig gig for someone of your ilk. This is cute and really cool. Okay, so we get a lot of money. So can I now buy bits? Guess not. Engines in progress. Fatcat needs you to find three missing engines for his factory. Okay. How do I... It doesn't look like it can build anything yet. And it doesn't look like it can change anything either. I notice that any game like this becomes less about color and about how fast you can pump out ammo. If I couldn't immediately get more ammo bits, that'd do it. But 
I don't know. I like it. Thank you ever so kindly for delivering the factory's building materials, but I'm afraid some of your cohorts weren't so lucky. A driver was delivering an engine to the factory site, but was foiled by rogue tanks on their way, blasted scoundrels. Sorry, the whole thing gets so hot under my collar, it gets me so hot under my collar, I could destroy a whole scratching post just thinking about it. Get out there and find those missing engines before anyone else does. They should be on a road to the north. So I'm noticing the player one, which means multiplayer. How does this work with that? I don't know, actually. I'm kind of curious. What the hell? Casey and the bat. Okay. Let's see. As usual, put tank together. Nope, all that doesn't work. Okay, let's do blue ammo. Yellow. Red. Damn it. Okay. Red beats yellow. Okay. This one seems to be a little bit more of a stinker. Okay. Oh, it's out. Okay, so it does... It does, in fact... Oh, we did, we did some major damage there. All right, works for me. Cause yeah, we actually had them on, uh, we had them repairing. And yeah, it looks like we can't get unlimited ammo of this. So if I'm going too fast, it doesn't actually work for me. That said, I'm not sure if that matters. Oh. Race of that. I'm just gonna stick that up a little bit. Let that recharge. Toss a double blue. There we go. Well, that one's. The wash. Maybe I'll get it back. Okay, how much HP do they have? Nothing. There he goes. Perfect. So, we want to do a couple more fights before I start going for the question marks. If I can manage it. Okay. I like the prickly canister. Uh, I guess what I should probably do is just look at these and do the math and just pick the ones that have the highest value. So this one's value is 16, 14, and 15. Yeah. I wish they actually had more unique effects, maybe. Oh, okay. I understand now. Um, so in that case, I think I might want to swing down. Because that'll give us the regular store and then the other store. Okay. So he has something cheap that's pretty good. So we'll grab the Megalodon. I guess we've got upgraded versions of each.
Oh, I can see what they upgrade into. So this one, the extra armor is kind of nice, but I don't think it's worth it. Oh. For 44, I could upgrade this into prickly canisters. So some of these actually have higher tiers that they can be upgraded into. That'd make it an 18. That's a 12. Both of those are 12s. I think I'm just gonna upgrade the yellow cannon, Paul, and call it close enough. I like the idea of going for bonus upgrades, but still. Yeah, let's go this way. I want to see what that other thing sells. Not that it matters. Hey, thank you, Oe the Owen, for the 37 month resub. Hope you're having a nice day, Wander. I am. I'm having a very nice day. It is a little toasty where I'm at, which is the one immediate problem. Let's see. Uh, no, that ain't gonna do it. What a mess. Uh, let's see. It's this one. On the plus side, the layout of my... My dude is now going to be pretty tough. Or not the layout, but the the rest of this is going to be nice and easy. Okay, so yellow beats blue. Looks like they're firing a fair bit of blue. It doesn't look like they've got any of the other fancier versions. My shark. Eat. My. Shark. Boy, those upgraded bullets, though. They are, uh, not messing around. Okay, he hasn't shot low yet. Which is good for me. I'm just gonna... Fire everything. Fire all of the guns. There he goes. Bam! Alright, we get money. We got another part. Huh. Surprises never cease. Final Fantasy IX might be getting a cartoon series. What? That's weird. I think I might go for the rocket ball. <sighs> I think there are... Yeah, I'll go for the rocket ball just because I don't have enough reds. Alright, so let's see what this shop has. How's that last tune-up treating you? This game is so cute. Okay, free tune-up, tune-up mystery upgrade. Okay, so not really worth saving the money unless I'm in a whole lot of danger. Oh, wait. No, this is like one of the most hilariously easy layouts I think I've ever seen. Oh, I don't have enough. I thought I would. And then I most definitely do not. It's fine. I I thought for a hot second that I had enough. this out. Okay, so it looks like he's aiming down. 
And screwed up his first shot, too. Okay. Well, works for me. If he's gonna... If he's gonna goof it, he's gonna goof it. Alright. We got him with a... A stun. Yeah, we're breaking something. That's a nice feeling. Good luck defending against this. Slime. I have the powers of infinite bullet spam. What do you have? Crap scrap? That actually looks to be entirely the case. It doesn't look like he's actually firing regular shots at me. There we go. Well, that was easy. I think it only shoots scrap. <laughs> Can you fire conveyors? That's... Oh, that's an interesting question. I'll have to test that. Connect tank delivery. By Jove, you've done it. You got the engines back to the factory. Now I can fire up the factory and have it start cranking out tanks in no time. Three cheers for owning the means of production. We get money. So maybe factory lets me modify my thing. I hope. When do I get to modify my tank? I have no idea. Maybe we have to do a... Oh, here we go. Better, faster, stronger. Bonnie Ray Quinn wants to make BRQ1 stronger. So after this mission, we unlock the meta uh, progression. Hello, I'm Bonnie Ray, Bonnie Ray Quinn. This is my good buddy, BRQ1. He's real friendly. I should know. I built him out of my spare scraps from tanks. I'm looking for some more scrap to make him stronger. If you find some on your way around the grasslands and forest, let me know. We'd both be real appreciative. Right, BRQ? All right. I think I might have to, uh... Well, I don't know. All right, let's take a look at this. So, there's some stuff. Looks like the level got a lot longer, too. <sighs> let's go for the sloth boy. Sloth just seems cute. Slow-mo. Weakness. Bullets. Um. Wait. No. This is the most simple tank I've ever had to squish together. Alright, first questions first. No. It does not like that. I cannot throw those in. Okay, I will admit, this layout here is bad, and is potentially going to make this a lot harder on me. Just because I have to do some kind of hefty long shots to get what I want. I'm toss that out. Okay. I guess I got the range for it, it's just a matter of... Not missing. Okay, got stuck. Also, kind of sucks a little bit. As it seems like... Let's see. It seems like I'm gonna have some trouble here. Boy. Keep that combo going if I can. Okay. I'm just trying to keep that time stun bonus combo up, if possible. 
I don't actually know what the time stand bonus combo is, unless that refuels my ammo faster. The enemy is weak. Thank you. I love it when I know my enemies are floundering. When they are incapable of responding to the amount of carnage I am throwing their way. You will not beat me, Sloth Boy, though you put up a better fight than most. I oh, was chucking anvils my way. I mean, a nominal effort I missed, but we're fine. Oh, okay. Combo may make your bullets move faster. I can see that. And we got a slow mo right arm. Aww. All right, so we probably want the prickly canister. Bong for more damage. Yeah, a little faster. And full ball, not so much though. Though it looks like maybe the armored ones are actually pretty good. Oh, scrap fuser. The scrap spawner makes two more scrap when it gets hit. Also, at the start of battle, it creeps, creates four purple scrap. Boost your ammo, air speed, and damage by one for every five damage taken, or... Boost your red ammo, air speed by eight, but inflicts five damage to your tank if you create trash ammo. I'm gonna go for the Scrap Fuser. Ruby Wings seems kind of interesting if it did more damage, but I don't care about speed. I like those chests, though. That's good stuff. Oh, boy. I'm not even gonna try and process what I'm looking at here. Purple. Purple, yellow. I'm just gonna throw whatever. I was hoping I'd get another red from that, but I didn't get any reds. Okay, this is gonna be a lot easier of a thing to shoot at. Oh, I did shoot, shoot some scraps, so it looks like purple might actually just not be useful. Oh! I see. Purple just fires uh, scrap out. So it it's not meant to be comboed with anything, it just lets me fire some really basic trash hits. I think. I could be wrong. Wow, they died in a hurry. And yeah, maybe it's wild if you put it in a second. Maybe. Okay. Well, doesn't matter. Uh, which is these is most valuable. It's a fifteen. Yeah, it does kind of seem like the uh, the extra armor might be more worth it than I. Think? I'm gonna go shark shell. Okay. So if I go down. Now let's go up. We want the bullet upgrades. Okay, I'll try it again with the purple. Um. I just think they should be fine. A lot of these look weird, weirdly complex, and then I look at them for like a, a smidge longer, and they're not. Um, 
Okay, so I was almost fine. Okay. So let's do a red and... Red and then a purple. What's this going to do? It's scrap. So pur purple is just scrap no matter what. And is not to be thrown with anything else. At least not to my knowledge. I, I don't know what he's doing. Does this guy just fire tons of scrap? Is that, is that its thing? It might, yeah. Well, we're absolutely hammering it. I think the armadillo is just trash. It, as far as I can tell, is trash. Yeah, just tossing the purple in made scrap, no second needed. Yeah, but people were saying that it might also be like a wild card that you can com combo with something else. But it's fine. Oh! Boost durability by one when the enemy has full HP. No. Boost conveyor belt, transport speed, and increases running speed when monsters are in your tank. Or inflict double damage when you exploit an enemy tank's weakness. Ah. I'm gonna go with, uh, Frankenlemon. Just because. So there may be monsters that actually climb inside my tank. I haven't seen that yet, but that's spooky. Alright, let's see what this guy has. Uh, let's start by upgrading. That's a 14. Now there is the Megalodon. Nah. I'd rather just have a bunch of really decent bullets across the board. Okay, he also should have this on sale. Yes. Ooh. That's an 18 right off the bat. Instead of upgrading further, let's just grab the goods. Okay. Wait. <laughs> is this is this really the layout I'm looking at? I I kind of love it when this happens. Certainly makes my life easier. <laughs> Eat scrap, boyo. Okay, so we need to we need to counteract some of that stuff. Okay, load those up. Yeah, I do hope, I really hope they fix up the music, though. It is, nope, well, that didn't work. On the plus side, as far as I can tell, we're skunking them. They're not prepared for this level of cheese, nor this level of firepower. I'm honestly curious what this would be like in a full group of multiplayer, just because it feels like uh, I alone am already ridiculous. It probably gets harder, I think is the main point. If you have all ammo of one color and the blueprints don't have a third color, do you make scrap out of it? Possibly. Oh boy, that scrap is perfect. <laughs> It'll fit perfectly on BRQ's left side. Don't tell him, but he's a little weak over there. Thanks so much, I hope I see you around. 
All right, let's see the meta progression. Mission reward money. Internet's finally working again. Hooray! Pardon me, I'm Olive. I've been waiting to see all the new projects on Go Tank Me. Want to take a look too? Grab your ticket. Go Tank Me. Tankers all over New Pangea have been designing new ammo and mods. They need a little entrepreneurial support to kickstart their projects, so they turn to crowdfunding on Go Tank Me. Okay. Fund any one of these, and you'll see it appear in New Pangea. Oh, you should fund that shiny thing. Wait. That over there looks pretty useful, too. I can't decide. How about you choose what to... Okay. Speed Aura. Boosts air speed of fired ammo inside air aura. Fires a bunch of weak red ammo. Effective against yellow ammo. Ooh. That's kind of fun. Good pick. As a packer, uh, backer pledge, you also get a prototype of any funded item for free, so you can try it out on your next gig. Funded items can appear as rewards, and some of them might even be stocked in New Pangea's shops. Okay, so expires after a gig. That's fine. I'm sure we'll get more. You can use scrap to damage monsters or activate switches just like conveyor belts. Also allows the scrap spawner to generate more scrap or boost HP capacity. But covers your tank in ink when you hit a cannon switch. Ooh. Burn ammo. Enemy tanks burn and gradually lose HP. That sounds really good. I might as well grab the speed aura. Okay, we also have the lance. Powerful and speedy, but fragile. I mean... I don't think we have enough. Gooey fuel seems kind of... Big miss. What about other mods? Boost your ammo durability by two on every fifth attack. Well, that's kind of fun. But what I really want to know is how do I modify my tank? I keep getting all these parts, but I can't I can't do a custom tank yet. Like we're still stuck with nuts nuts and bolts. Oh, I also only get one bullet and one mod per run, so I shouldn't I shouldn't overbuy. 